Oh my god, sub with a 10 to one gift these subs. But yeah, back, um... Everyone asked, okay, since everyone wants to talk about servers, this, servers, that. Like I said, there's still a lot of processes for servers. And all I can say is nothing is off the table right now. And also including other people as well, you know what I mean? Like, you guys, the problem is assumption, but people just assume. That's the issue, where people are assuming. Like, for example, in the statement. Obviously, I can't say anything further. I can only say what's in the statement, obviously, which is fine. There was a line that said, uh, there have been no official statements made in relation to the complaints. People are so negative and so, like, they have so much hate in their heart. They, they try and turn it into something that it's not. All that means is, after everything illegal got involved, after, you know, the legal discourse, the investigations, all that got involved, the people who made the complaints, complaints which are also known as allegations, right? They took it back. They didn't make anything official. Once, it, once shit got real, they dipped, pretty much. That's it, that's it. Like, I've literally seen people, I've literally seen people say, I wish something did happen. Like, that's how, so that I would have got fucked, pretty much. Like, yeah, how fucking hateful you have to be, bro. Go outside, man. Enjoy life. Genuinely, enjoy life. I, the internet is so weird. Jimmy Tulip, bro. My brother. Ah, people are just so, oh, so hateful. They turn it around. They just want to find, like, the worst. And I'm going to be honest with you, chat. There's still a lot I'm going to say about uh the situation obviously i can't i really wish i could just leak every not leak but like just say everything but i can't and i wouldn't and i'm not but it's just i didn't do it for anyone else apart from me you understand like there's no like i didn't do it to prove to other people to try and get this person back like that get that person back or something on my shoulders I did. I know I did everything I possibly could in my situation with how little I had. And I, uh, I, th I always knew I was going to get to this moment. I always knew it. I just didn't know when I got here. And it's just for me. Now I can actually just move on. Because people would tell me, like, why don't you move on? Why don't you do this? Just push through it. Ah, bro, I would never, ever, ever encourage anyone. If you believe in something, if you know something, always fight for yourself. Because no one else will at the end of the day. No one else will. So... Even if people say, but it's stupid to do that. Don't do it. Or if someone says, brothers, you're wasting your time. Just move on. Just do it for yourself. Don't do it for anyone else. Don't try and prove to people. Because the right people will come in your life. One way or another. Okay? And we all have issues. And we all have problems. Okay? But, like, the best advice I can give if anyone is stuck in a situation where they feel hopeless, where they feel a lot of pain, and even, like, to a point where, you know... They want to end it because they think the pain will stop. Remember one thing. Sewer, sewer sliding, okay, you understand what I'm saying? That is not a solution because what that, what that does is it takes that pain and it transfer, transfers it to someone else. Probably 10 times worse. I swear to God. I swear, just you always got to just push through it. Always improve other aspects of your life. Even if that problem seems hopeless, if you improve, like, family, life, if you, if you uh, improve, like, your money, your socials, your body, your heart, like, you know, getting to, going to the gym, meeting people, going outside, and just fixing other aspects, I promise you that one main problem you have that seems impossible, it will get fixed, eventually, somehow. Open volume mixer and you should see soundbar. Open volume mixer, brother. Let me see. Oh, it's annoying. 